Hello, I hope you're having an amazing day. So I'm gonna walk you through one of my favorite techniques to shift your energy because when we get triggered or we have like a fear moment or like this overwhelming limiting belief that's just like overriding everything and making it really hard for you to take action or like find the peace that you want and you just wanna feel like safe and secure, this is something that I love because when we are afraid of things, it's like we really just want to feel safe. We want to feel secure in our body and based on like past things that happened, our mind is kind of lazy. So it kind of, if something comes up, it looks back for like a situation that was similar in the past and it wants to like see how you reacted to it then and almost wants to recreate that in the moment. And if what happened in the past wasn't helpful or supportive or it was a trauma or whatever it was that was going on, um, the thing that makes a trauma is like a strong negative emotion combined with the feeling of not being able to escape. You have no way of getting away from it. So the technique that I'm teaching you is called havening. And it's called that because basically we are creating a safe haven for you so that you remove the emotional charge around like that belief or memory or feeling and then you can kind of realign your nervous system with feeling calm. And the way that we do this is we release delta waves into your body, which are like a relaxing brainwave state. And we also confuse the trigger because when you're triggered by something, there's like a chemical reaction of a series of things that happens in your brain. And so those things will, it'll be like, there's the stimulus and then straight away your mind will be like, okay, now we're going to this and then this. And it's like a fear response. And it happens so quickly, we don't even really have a chance to sit there and think about it or rationalize because from an evolutionary perspective, like if you were sitting there deciding if you were gonna run away from the lion or not, well, that's too late, you're probably eaten now but there is no lion probably in your immediate situation. So we wanna just kind of retrain your brain and de take the emotional intensity out of those memories or that, um, that trigger, that stimulus. So I'm gonna show you this technique, it's called havening. It's super easy to do on yourself. It only takes 10 minutes and it is so powerful. So basically I want you to either get a limiting belief into your mind or like a memory that was really painful, was really triggering. This is a safe space. It's okay for it to come up. Um, it could be just a thought or a belief or a feeling that's really annoying you. And I want you to just sit there and think about it now. You can like close your eyes and think about that thing, that feeling, that thought, belief. I want you to really feel into it in your body, reactivate it. And I want you to give that memory or feeling um, a rating on a scale of zero to 10, zero being like, this isn't a problem and 10 being like, this is a huge issue. <laughs> like it's massive. So think about that thing and get the feeling into your mind. And then you can open up your eyes again. And basically the technique is, it's like this. You're going from your shoulders down to your elbows in like a circular motion. It's like you're giving yourself a hug. And even now you can sort of feel how relaxing that feels. And so basically now I want you to keep doing the havening touch, the havening technique, that's what we're doing right now. And think about that thing in your mind for one last time. I want you to keep going with the havening touch. I'm just gonna pause. And I want you to think about that thing for one last time, really activate it. And now I just want you to imagine that it's like we're going to drain your brain. You're pulling the plug on the bathtub and all this dirty water is like swirling out of you until it's going to run clear. We're just draining your brain from all of those thoughts, all of those beliefs, all of those memories and continue to apply the havening touch. And now I just want you to open your eyes for a moment and I want you to just tap on your collarbones and as you tap on your collarbones, I want you to just follow my, follow with your eyes my finger, keeping your head still, still tapping on your collarbones. Amazing. Now close your eyes down. Continue to apply the havening touch. And so I just want you to imagine that you are on a beautiful beach and there's a light breeze and you can feel the sunshine, you can smell the air 
and it's the most beautiful beach you've ever been to and now we're just going to take a walk away from those feelings and memories that were not <laughs> feeling great for you and so as I count you're going to imagine taking a step and so now we're gonna walk away so 20 19 18 17 16 15 14 13 12 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Amazing. And just open up your eyes, still applying that havening touch. I want you to just follow my finger with your eyes again. Great, now close down your eyes again, still applying that havening touch. And now I want you to imagine in front of you is a big lawn. And on either side, you're surrounded by tall oak trees and it's a beautiful sunny day. And you can hear the birds chirping in the trees and the leaves rustling. Now we're gonna take another 20 steps. So just following now with your eyes closed, applying the havening technique. 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. Now you can open your eyes and I want you to think back to that memory that you first got at the beginning. And now I want you to think about where that number is rated on the scale. And I'm sure some of you might be down to zero, some of you might be a one or a two. And if it's not down to zero, I want you to go back to the start of this video and repeat it until you get it down to a one or a zero. And if you're at a zero now, I want you to just take a deep breath in and breathe out and take another deep breath and breathe out. And just one final breath. And as you exhale, just let out an audible sigh. <sighs> and that's it. You've completed the havening technique. And so I just want you to rem remember to come back to this every time that you feel like you need it. It can even be an amazing addition to your morning ritual to just really clear out any negative emotions, get you feeling really calm. And the reason you feel so good is because we've released a lot of delta waves into your body, which is really relaxing. And then we've also confused that like mental pattern with your fear response and the emotion. I think if you even try and imagine back to like that situation that you had in the beginning, some of you will even struggle to make the picture. It's like, it's just gone. That emotional charge is there and it's like, it doesn't come back. So this is a super powerful technique. I hope you loved it and I will see you soon.